What's up, YouTube? It's the Doctor, aka the Cookie Monster New Cleveland. And today, I have a full game for you guys today. And this is the full game with the Memphis Grizzlies with Rudy Gay. And yes, this is my, the last gameplay I will ever play with them because obviously I can't deal crap with them now because now they got Rudy Gay. But still, this is a good gameplay because, well, you, it's like the last time you guys get to see him on the Grizzlies. And I'm actually kind of happy I got this gameplay in because. This was the day that Rudy Gay got traded, so I didn't even know he got traded before this game. And actually, this is my first time playing with the Grizzlies, so I'm happy I at least got one game in with them when Rudy Gay was still on the team, because that would have been kind of disappointing if I never got a game in with them. But, um, yeah, that's basically what I was going to say. Like, Rudy Gay, I mean, he's one of the best players in 2K at taking people to the rack. Him and Iguodala. Him and Iguodala are the best at taking people and just dunking completely over them. I'm going to say Iguodala is a little better, but Rudy Gay will do it a lot, too. Um, I have him on my my team. Uh, if you put spot-up shooter on him, he's one of the best players. He was my biggest pickup for my team besides, like, maybe Melo. But, that yeah, that's basically what I'm saying about Rudy Gay. He's, he's a good player, and he'll help the Raptors make the playoffs next year. I don't know about this year, but next year they'll make the playoffs. And I'm playing against the Portland Trail Blazers, and he has, you know, Damian Lillard. But right there, that's what I'm talking about. I played one game with Rudy Gay, and he just dunks over people. And that's what made me get him. Right after this game, I go pick up Rudy Gay on my, my team. I sell, uh, oh, I sell Amari Stunemeyer and put... Rudy Gay at my small forward and Carmelo at my power forward. So that's like a really cheesy lineup, but it works for me. But right now I'm losing by two. This is a full con because you know he's going to quit. But uh, it's a pretty good rage quit. I mean, not even kidding. I love when people rage in 2K because you can see what when they quit and crap. But right there, I'm taking Rudy Gay to the rack again, and he gets the easy dunk posterizing over Wesley Matthews. Um, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like He's a great dunker, and they need to fix that. I hate kickball violation. They should just take that out of the game. Not in NBA, but in 2K13. Because it bounces off everybody's foot once the ball gets stolen or something. It's really annoying. Oh, I hate that so much. <laughs> but LaMarcus Aldridge, he is an all-star this year, is going to the free throw line. And he hits the first. And he hits the second. But really, I all-star predictions. I think the West I think is probably going to win. Oh, no. I need to rethink about this. I, I mean, it's usually a close game. Like, last year, the what, the East was down by, like, 20, and LeBron just went super, super try-hard in it. So, you never know. If LeBron decides to go try-hard, Kyrie goes try-hard, Dwayne Wade goes try-hard, you know, I don't know. It's going to be a good game. Uh, I think Kyrie could have the possibility of being the MVP. You heard what I said. Kyrie Irving could be the, the player of the game. Besides, I mean, you have to say, say LeBron. If the East wins, it's either Kyrie or LeBron. No, I'm not. Even, that's like the only people that could win it, you know, because Dwayne Wade doesn't score as much points as he used to. But you know, Dwayne, uh, LeBron will just pass the ball to Wade all the time. Cause he, I, if I were Kyrie, I wouldn't even want to pass it to LeBron, knowing what he did to Cleveland, you know. <laughs> so. Memphis Grizzlies right now are up two against the Blazers and right there Rudy Gay he cannot get a dunk but there's Zebo and Zebo did Zebo did make the All Star team this year and I think people were questioning if he should have made it or if Steph Curry because I'll tell you what Charles Barkley was pretty mad when Steph Curry did not make the team uh, he was cussing on TNT I think he got fined for it but whatever <laughs> he doesn't care right he has all that money he doesn't. Need to pay. He doesn't care if he pays or not, you know. Uh, but I have played with Mike Conley before. He was on one of my uh, associations, so I am used to him. I know he's a great shooter, and I, Rudy Gay isn't that good of a shooter. But if you put spot up shooter, he's a, everybody's a good shooter. Shooter when you do put spot up shooter on right there, breaking some ankles, taking him to the rack. Rudy Gay. He is such a boss in this game. I love those guys like Melo, Rudy Gay. I haven't really played with LeBron a lot because, you know, cheesy team they are. But I'm good with those type of small forwards. And I, w uh, I can dunk with uh, Like, I can't use Blake because he can't. He doesn't have a lot of ball handling skills that I like to use. But Rudy Gay and Melo are probably my favorite small forwards in the game. Alonzo G, he's a great dunker. I think they kind of overrated him in this game because he's a great dunker when he's wide open. And 
he can like dunk over three people in this game, but I'll take it. You know, <laughs> he's a great dunker in the open. I'll, I'll just say that, but he, I, they overrate him a little in this game. <laughs> and right there, he gets uh, Marcus Saul gets fouled. He oh, that's not Marcus Saul. I don't even know who that is, but um, he hated a. <laughs> but the, the this was after no, this was before. Four. No, this was after the trade that the Cavs got uh, Wayne Ellington and uh, Maurice Spates for John Luer or something like that. Uh, so I, I have Luer or whatever, but he's not. I mean, that was a terrible trade for Memphis, <laughs> to be honest with you. Right there, Regain misses the three. Tony Allen gets the rebound. Up, oh, you jump, I don't. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's my little phrase right there. But Mike Conley wide open for three. He misses because he's not on the left side. That is a little tip for you guys. If you guys want to make threes, go to the dominant hand. On that side, it'll be wide open. And right here, he's going to wham. He's going to quit. What a game for the doctor. Look at that. He has quit the game. That is basically all I wanted to show you guys. I hope you guys watched that tutorial I made a couple days ago. Because Rudy Gay, man. I just made a tutorial on the 360. You guys can go check it out. It'll be in, you know, you guys can just go to my recent videos and look at it. Alright, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoy. Let's go here.